Hello again here from Ceuta. I just give you a little update about uh, this situation. Yeah, it's bubbling. It's a lot of uh, crazy stuff happening actually in the population because again, two years, over two years now, everything is closed. And yes, there is a kind of a, a war going on between young people here in Ceuta. Yeah, so because some days ago a uh, 15 year old um, male got shot here from a drive-by and this is uh, yes because there is nothing else to do uh, in Ceuta than um, the, you know driving around and getting crazy because that was well, some weeks ago the policeman shot his wife yeah and yesterday there were in the night there were some uh, people and they tried to put this car here on fire and um, just the, the, as you can see this car just next to our camp and uh, yeah it was on fire but I uh, uh, fortunately we I, I, we have seen it and uh, yeah I, I put the fire out and uh, yes but it's at uh, the the ambiente it's uh, bubbling it's also the whole the whole situation because of the border it's not clear they will now say okay it opens at the first of um, May if I'm not <laughs> if I'm not in doubt eh, now with the dates sorry uh, I, I'm not really up to up to to date with the date so uh, um, yeah they're just saying uh, it will open but they're not sure when but for sure is that thousands of people passing this border and even there was um, yeah, some weeks ago when the, the, this storm was, you know, the storm and there was like a little tornado even here in uh, Ceuta and so at the coast the, a lot of things damaged, that's why they're also in delay because they have to make the, uh, the renovations, they have to make the, everything clear for the border opening and because of this uh, uh, weather storm um, yeah also th stuff got damaged here at the beach and then where is the border and even in, in uh, the Mar Moroccan side in Castilijo what I heard there was a, a fire like a, a fire and um, yeah they, then they, uh, they didn't have the firefighters uh, in there around in Morocco so they called the firefighters from Ceuta so can you imagine that that some weeks ago the firefighters from Ceuta went through the border so the police opened the border for the firefighters to go to Morocco to put down a fire and then they come back again and we are here already this whole this whole weeks you know this months now already here and we just want our right what is passing the border because this border is again is the whole cause for this the people uh, shoot each other the people uh, uh, are in depression uh, that's the whole uh, cause of it it's the border again that's the whole cause you can even uh, you know you can trace everything back to the border yes to the border and to the racism what is this caste system this this uh, uh, supremacist thing so that also the people here even if their mother tongue is mostly Arab in the school they will not uh, uh, learn Arab so this is a very 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 uh, bad education let's say and this is uh, yeah the people then they have uh, no real culture and then uh, yeah so education is the key again and uh, but for sure soon 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 we will pass the border uh, but we're still here working a lot and uh, yeah keep you updated this was just uh, to know that um, if you want to to help and <laughs> you know save the children in the real way just uh, yeah help uh, 
you know, educational um, programs, you know, also support us, uh, spread these videos, you know, because it's very important that the young people get the right education. So, Cha bless everyone. Uh, today uh, started the school again. It was the Semana Santa, so it was holidays. Now the school started again. So then you can see again uh, the small children with the mask going uh, to school and learning all these lies about uh, the human history and science. So that is our responsibility as we know more and better uh, than uh, the doctors and then the teachers uh, and even the most of the police and even the most um, of the judges to be honest uh, to be honest um, we know more about this whole law um, like the history the laws the history of the laws yeah the whole story yeah? so we know even more about that than the so-called judges and um, yeah so this is uh, something we should uh, think about that so thank you so much Ciao bless everyone see you soon daniel one love karen